Hello, everyone. Jacqueline Bergpile here, assistant editor of the Church of Church Pop. Uh, right here, we have Father Mike Schmitz, assistant to the assistant editor at Church <laughs> yeah. Pop. <laughs> yes, but not really. Okay. So yeah, we so have there six are people, people watching. coming. Hey, There's people watching. It's just not saying that we have anybody here. <laughs> so, or that we have any, it's a zero, oh, they're zero. Liking. You guys are liking. Okay, good. Yeah. Hey, give us a like if you can see this right now. Yeah, or a comment. Oh, wait. Yeah. So. Mm -hmm. um, there it is. Oh, okay, yay, good. there's good. one. I don't know why it's not doing that. Okay. Okay. Hi, Sarah. Yeah. So, anyway, um, let's. Yeah, so we're going to do a really fun interview today. We're going to do like 20 questions or something with Father Mike Schmitz. Whatever. There's 20. Yeah, there's 20. Okay. If it. we have time for 20. If we don't have time for 20, then we'll do 10 or whatever. <laughs> as many as we can. Yeah, as many as possible. Ooh, we have a lot of people coming. So let's wait a second and see. Oh, okay. So it was, we, they were just notified. That's why it said zero, zero. Ramon does. Greetings from Lithuania. Hey, greetings from Indianapolis. Yeah. So we, right now, we are at SEEK 2019 in Indianapolis. See? Yeah. So, and again, this is Father Mike Schmitz. If you haven't heard of him, he has an awesome show on Ascension, Ascension Presents, and um, it, or Ascension Presents, right? Yep. Okay, yep. yeah, and you can look him up on YouTube. Anyway, so we're going to get started on a really cool 20-question thing. Actually, there's still people coming, so why don't we just wait a second? Yeah. Oh, you want to get started? No, they're not really very long questions, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> um, but anyway, okay. So see, see. Oh yeah, these are great. These are like super short. Yep, okay. I'm ready. So they're gonna be fun. Okay. Okay. In okay. the meantime. In the meantime. I'm gonna tell a story. You? Yeah. You wanna tell a story? Yeah. Okay, tell a story. Go. Okay, right now. Yeah. Just kidding. I was trying to think of a story. <laughs> so, okay, here's the story. Um, you might not know about this because it just happened to me the other night. The other night, at the very first night of Seek here, Aaliyah Darrow, uh, who uh, is great, she was gonna give a, the opening talk, one of the opening talks. And so Sister Miriam Headland, who's amazing, and Sarah Swafford and I were back with Leah to pray with her before her talk. She's one of the ones in person. So um, here is, uh, here's Leah, and behind her is Sister Miriam, and on this side is Sarah Swafford. And so I just kind of put my hand on her shoulder to you know, pray, ask them the Lord to you know, bless Leah. And her three to four, thank you for <laughs> entering the part. Yeah. So her like three or four year old son is standing right here, and he starts punching me in the leg saying, Get away from my mom! Get away from my mom! And I was just like, "This is so great!" And so finally, your prayer ends, and he's like, he's pushing me away, and I'm like, "That is so great!" It was a great story, and Leah said, "I'm going to tell him about that when he gets older." So good. But I just thought, what an incredible! He's three or four, and he's already has like the heart of like the protector, heart of the defender, Aww, and just wanted to protect wow, his mom. Wow, that's so sweet! Like, oh my god! Well done, Ricky, and well done, Leah, because they just the little man is already being a little man. Oh, that's so cute! Yeah, I have a I have a son who's almost exactly the same age. Really? I think we had a baby like three months apart. Nice. Anyway, yeah. Okay, something like that. All right, let's get started on our questions since there's 80 people here, All which right. is pretty good. So anyway, okay, Father Mike, what's your favorite color? Blue. Favorite food? Steak. Favorite sports team? I do not follow sports. Okay. And I do not follow team sports. So I might follow individual sports, but I intentionally don't follow team sports because I think they're stupid. <laughs> and everyone, everyone who likes them is also stupid. Just kidding. That's not true. No. But um, no, I don't know team sports. See, my husband told me not to ask you that because he's like, you're going you're gonna to make a lot of people mad. Not at all. Yeah. I'm, I'm the definition of a fair weather fan. If the bike Minnesota Vikings are doing well, I'm like, yeah, go bikes. If they're not doing well, I'm like, yeah, figures. They're no good. Yeah. I don't watch sports either fan. much, Whatever. but you know. It's okay. So, okay, favorite drink? Like, uh, non-alcoholic. Oh, beer. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> non-alcoholic. Beer. And then wine, red wine. It's not. Wow. Okay. Well, that's great. <laughs> but IPAs. what kind of beer? India Pale Ales. I've never heard of that. IPAs? The India Pale Ale comes anyway. from, okay, anyways. <laughs> okay. Less than an IPA. All right. Uh, favorite Catholic speaker? I was going to say, <laughs> um, who, uh, there's so many. Okay, no, my, okay, so I'm um, not speaker, but uh, 
he, well, gosh, so it's last night, Father, Father, Dr. Scott Hahn got an award. Mm -hmm. And I was just so moved by like, oh my gosh, this man has influenced me in such an incredible way. Not just him personally with his teaching, but all the people that have taught me have been in some way taught by him too. And I thought, oh my gosh, that's phenomenal. So he's pretty awesome. But the guy who has my, my, been my go-to recently for just deep knowledge of scripture has been Dr. Brant Petrie. He's just, oh, he's so good. He is just amazing. So, okay. Awesome. A lot of people are great. He just, but really he's your favorite. Him. He will not favorite. To, to you, for you, no, to I help you. Favorite movie. It helps me a lot. Uh, the number one movie on IMDb right now is Shawshank Redemption. So how could I go against the people? Shawshank's great. So is Braveheart. So is It's a Wonderful Life. Oh, I love that movie. That's my favorite. Okay. Um, I watched that like two weeks ago. Nice, me too. Yeah. Twins. Yeah. Okay. Um, favorite TV show? Um, the Office. Okay. Uh, Is if there any other TV show? Who's your girlfriend? The church? Good answer. I was gonna say, I was say Mary, she's a mom. I was, uh, I was hoping church. you'd say Mary. Church. I was thinking you would say I'm Mary in the church. I'm yeah. Yeah. Okay. I kind of the bridegroom, whatever. Um, Theology. Any weird talents? Oh, it's fine weird. Like your double jointed, or you can you know make your arm. I go can like step this. my arm. <laughs> I can. I can make my arm go like this. No, Both like of bend. Them back. Yeah, they do bend. Yeah. Sorry. Uh, no, uh, I can grow a beard, and I occasionally, yeah. That's a really good talent. Okay, so I grow a beard because I, uh, my dad, when I was growing up, I'd always have a beard in the winter, and he'd come in from running or from cross country skiing and have an ice beard. So, oh. so as a kid, I was like, someday, that's me. And so that thing, for, as soon as I could grow a beard, I would just grow it in the winter until I got a nice beard, and then I could shave it off. I got a good nice beard last week, and I was going to shave, but our focus missionary said, no, 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 keep it for Sikh. So, uh, so you kept it. Now yeah. you're like all... Now all scraggly. Yeah. yeah. Uh, if you stood in front of Jesus, what question would you like to know the answer to? May I please come into heaven? Oh, <laughs> Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> um, okay, so let me see if there's another one here. If your life was a TV show, which one would it be? The Office. <laughs> okay, we are almost out of time, so I'm going to ask him one more question. If there was one thing you wish people knew about Catholicism, what would it be? That it is... Um, you went deep all of a sudden. What the heck? <laughs> my, last, my last answer was the office. And now, um, that there's no greater life that can possibly be lived than the life as a Catholic Christian. Awesome. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank okay. You so thank you for Thanks tuning Facebook in. Live. Thanks, Church Pop. We thank you for tuning in and. Be sure to catch Father Mike Schmitz on his show, Ascension Presents, on uh, YouTube. And keep following us on Instagram for more content and more interviews throughout the afternoon on Facebook. Have a great day. Awesome.